with intuitive dreams and welcome to an angels and guides art piece so for this one I will be going through the symbolism and when I first did the reading the archangels came through and said that they wanted to make it like a galaxy and that they were holding on to planets or on top of planets and, and, and stars and the Milky Way and stuff like that and they said that this person he is doing a lot of work to help people all over the world and himself he's changing and growing he's connecting stronger to the archangels and one thing that they gave me we're going to start with some of the symbolism is angelic study and learning so he is one of their students and that's why everyone is all around him and he is holding up the earth and if anyone is familiar with energy work those are reiki symbols so the first one is shoku rei and daikomiya is like overall master symbol and seiheki so these you can use to heal protect and things like that and then balance is another one so he could literally focus on this connect with everybody on it and the planet and put those symbols on parts of the planet where people are really you know struggling suffering war strife and now i'm going to go over here to the uh, right and we have archangel Raphael who's helping him with healing light and love and he is connecting with the planet mars so he picked mars that he is by and this is his healing symbol and that's by an angelic symbols book so i'm using um, different symbols that he can focus on and also put in his own healing practices and the next one we have is archangel michael and michael is hold he is showing a symbol of a key and this one was a symbol of health and healing and then we have the planet sirius so he wanted to him he could connect with these planets um the energy of them you know so this goes way deeper than it just being a drawing so this right here this is the symbol for the serious angels so he could connect with the serious angels and with this one like i was saying he could connect with raphael that's raphael's symbol now over here i'm going up to jophiel and she said she wanted to be like a milky way or you know things like that so i made it where there's like a swirl and she's floating in the center and that's her symbol so he could connect with her and then up here we have archangel uriel and he has uranus and um he wanted me to put the symbol cherubim in here so this person can connect with the cherubim at any time to bring in more love and light that they are open to work with him and this is uriel's symbol also and uriel said i want to be surrounded by stars and it's funny because i'm wearing a shirt that is surrounded in stars <laughs> now these two weren't originally a part of the art piece but these archangel well one's an archangel and one is a prophet from a pre you know like back in the old days so we have archangel sandophon wanted to be it's kind of like they made up their own planets but sandophon wants to be included as someone that he can work with to help him with his journey and now this right here is ezekiel and ezekiel was a prophet and i think he was connected to the jewish religion but he also lived in babylon so this is encouraging him to read about ezekiel and connect with ezekiel okay and then right here metatron was just like i just want to be like a shooting star so i put a star and there's his symbol in there and here's his name so it's like the shooting star um he wanted to be that and he said i want to help you to be in alignment with your true self always now the next one is shamuel and for a lot of people that know shamuel he can work with people on love finances their lives you know like bringing what's missing to your life but he said connect with me on a deeper on a deeper way so we have the greens the pinks and he also said that you can work with the color so he chose pluto which is a little smaller planet and then there's a symbol which is angels so he can use those symbols again and connect with it i feel like everything here is homework for him it's all for him when he feels like he's feeling sad low needs help here's everything on here that he could do who he could connect with what he could what he could work with to help himself 
Now the last one we have is Gabriel. Now I kind of see Gabriel as more of a male, but I have, you know, like there's different versions of Gabriel where I've seen Jibril and I've seen Gabrielle, you know. So, but for Gabriel, I got to draw a woman here and then she is holding the sun. And she said to put this symbol angelic truth. So again, he can write these symbols on himself, you know, like on his body, things like that, like the Reiki symbols. Sometimes you like visualize that you're drawing it on yourself. And then we have, these are the angels of the sun. So again, what they're telling me that it's not just a pretty picture, it's that for him to connect with these planets, the energy of them, that we can connect with anything that we are so unlimited. That's what this art piece is about. And thank you everyone for watching. I'm just gonna go a little bit closer in.